I did not involve my father in my business, not while I was a practicing lawyer, not in my investments or transactions domestic or international, not as a board member, and not as an artist. Oversight Committee Chairman James Comer insisted that Biden was lying and that the process to get him, President Joe Biden, and the Department of Justice to cooperate. Corruption is a cancer, a cancer that eats away at a citizen's faith in democracy. And most importantly, it divide, denies the people their dignity. Corruption is just another form of tyranny. Speaker, Speaker Johnson has accused you of lying repeatedly about your interactions with your son and brother's business partners. What's your re response to him? Don't read the record of every single witness. These guys got to stop. But you did interact with their partners. I did not interact with their partners. You didn't have dinner or lunch or coffee? I apologize for not getting a chance to talk to you at the luncheon yesterday. I was having trouble getting away from hosting President Hugh, Biden told Archer in the letter dated January 2020. And the basis of what we've learned is that the Bidens didn't have a legitimate business. Their business was selling access to Joe Biden, the brand. And what we've learned is, is a little bit about the business model from three different associates that said that uh, Joe Biden uh, communicated with the people right before the closing, so he was the closure, the closer of the of the influence peddling scheme, and that in in at least two cases, one was CEFC, which was one that Hunter Biden was was leading, one of the influence peddling schemes that he was leading, and one with uh, Jim Biden, which was the AmeriCorps deal that Politico did a good job writing about. Uh, both times, uh, in their scheme in their pitch to obtain money in their influence peddling scheme, they said Joe Biden was interested in an equity ownership stake and that Joe Biden might even, if the price is right, be on the board. It's a mirage to believe that Hunter Biden was engaged in international business. This was uh, a bribe masquerading as an international business transaction. Nothing more, nothing less.